this is just constant terror and failure. <laughs> is what this is. <laughs> nice little breaks of failure in between my terror. Oh! Son of a bitch! Yo, what's going on everybody? Riot's here, back with my Ark Survival Evolved modded. I just loaded in. Can someone please tell me how the hell the Scorpion got in my cage? Like this, I literally just loaded in. I have no idea how this happened, but I'm like, dude, he's not, he's like weak. It's a primordial Scorpion too, mean, meaning it's a boss creature. How the hell, how did he get in my cage? Like there's literally no logical explanation to how he got in here. This is like the most preposterous thing of my freaking life right here. Oh good, he's attacking my turrets. It's fantastic. I mean, even the side thing, I freaking put a little wall here. There's there's absolutely no way for him to be getting into this base. I don't even understand it a little bit, dude. It's starting to drive me insane. <laughs> Just load into these videos. And this guy's always there's always scorpions in our base. Forever. With their insane damage reduction and their giant scorpion balls. I won't have it. I think he should just die from venom, right? He just struck the hell out. What's he doing to me? I've been dismounted. Or not dismounted. I've been grounded. This is... Come on. Just bleed to death. I can't even move. Oh, God. He got me again. Oh, my God. What if we die right now? Oh, shit. Oh, my God. 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 Oof. That was a close one. That was a horrifying way to start this video. Why does that keep happening to me, dude? Where are they coming from? It's, 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 it's a constant existing problem in my life. Oh my god, fine, okay, and, and welcome to today's episode. Now we can finally start, now that my panic attack has gone, and another one is almost in the base. That is just, are they coming through the fence? How are they getting through this one, though? This is an electric fence! This literally zaps stuff that tries to even touch it. I don't understand it at all anymore. Okay, so today we're finally gonna go try and tame Rodan. There's like two Rodans on the map. We added in a Dino Tracker mod, which I always thought was kind of cheap, so I always avoided using it, but I've since seen multiple YouTubers, like ARC YouTubers, big ones using it, so I was like, oh, okay, so we can just use that thing. It's not cheap then. Which is gonna come in handy because for some reason Rodan has like the lowest render distance ever. The mod developer who made him kind of like stopped modding since COVID became a thing, so he probably won't get, he's a perfect creature, but his render distance is so low that you just, just you have to have a tracker to find him, otherwise he's just gonna torture you. I'm freaking stacked on these babies right here. Look at this, 43 of these bad boys. That's where we go Rodan hunting, cause that's just like the most necessary thing on the planet. Those which I, although Rodan does have like 15 million Torpor, I'm pretty sure, so I have no idea if we're gonna be able to get him. It's completely in the air. Make sure you leave a like on today's video if you guys wanna help see my channel hit a million together. We can do it, everybody. Now before we start, I know a lot of you guys weren't into this gardening stuff. I could tell, cause my average watch time was much lower on the last ARC video, cause you guys, you guys watch my channel for monsters and dinosaurs not to watch me get a whole garden going so i figured i'd take the liberty of just kind of doing a bit of it off camera this is all actually super basic it looks like i did a lot but i just kind of crafted the beginner stuff now look this is literally the top mod on the arc workshop it's been the top mod for a week i promise you it's an insane mod a lot of people have seen me picking flowers and planting roses and stuff for like wow this this series went downhill But I promise you this mod gets insane as hell. So I'm just gonna cover stuff real quick It's been like a day since I've messed with this and I forget everything in about four hour span Where did I leave off this baby right here actually wasn't Beatrix wasn't expensive at all Her only purpose is crafting these essence of life, which she uses. It's like prime meat, right? Yeah, looks like we crafted them all up We have our anthills over here, which are producing what they were meant to a uh, dirt and well, they're meant to be producing some of the- Where's my- Where's my poop? Where's my fancy poops? It's these right here. Compost middle. There's compost small, middle, and large. I should have had more of those crafting. I dropped the ball on that. I did tame a few dodos just for the sake of poop collecting. Um, I am gonna name these dodos after random people in the comment section. I wanted to tame like 50 do uh, dodos for this, but the server kept crashing because of some other mods. So, I'm gonna have- I guess I can do that later today. I just couldn't do it. That's all the poops you guys have to offer? Trying to remember what I do with these poops. The poops go into this, which oh, okay, that's what it was. I was getting thatch and fiber mixed up. Uh, sleep deprivation is a bitch, <laughs> but there we go. We got our stuff crafting. Now these plants were kind of messing up. I'm just gonna show you guys real quick because I promise this mod's insane. Okay, over here I basically just went crafting the necessary stuffles, just like the beginner stuffles. It's basically you need these herb seedlings too, and this is where I've left off with my intelligence regarding the mod is you use these babies to make we've crafted this first layer of seeds right here we have all this going now we just need salad seedling to get the other ones going and then you use these resources to craft all kinds of crazy stuff so like oregano parsley aloha uh thyme this kind of stuff i haven't actually checked on the farm yet i have this one going over here for those specific food seeds 
keep my food separate. Okay, over here we have... What are you, sir? We've got pollen tube. I'm confused. Chamomile. Okay. I don't know what a po pollen tube is part of the male gameo type. Typhi? Typhit? Tiffit? Enables the pollen of the pollen grain to be transported to fertilize the female ovals. I am so out beyond my pay grade with what to do with this stuff. I'm going to have to come mess with it again off camera. Because I'm, I'm immediately confused. I haven't actually checked inside of these yet. Get some dill pickles. Get some basic food res- Oh, some mint? Forget about it, bro. About to have some minty snacks. I don't- I've never heard of half of these things. I've, I've heard of mint. I've heard of rosemary. I think rosemary smells good. Chives? I've never heard of chives in my freaking life before. Thyme? Thyme? I feel like I've heard of that. I feel like- What's this? Aloe vera. Yeah, I, I remember- I know a little vera, pretty dead parsley. Oh, this is the one right here. Okay. <laughs> Wait, you're just plant species Z. You were supposed to have something special. I was really hoping this one dropped leaves. You just grow plant species Z. That's, I'm pretty sure it's not what I put inside that thing. How did I not notice this as soon as I walked in? <laughs> I feel like that should have been the first thing to poke out. So I'm not necessarily sure what to do with all this crap just yet. There's a lot. This isn't rendering just yet. Come on, load in little buddy. I guess you'd use it for like these resources, right? Making crazy ass foods. I'm gonna drop it in here for the sake of crazy ass foods. Yeah, but she need some chili and then we can make them some spice mix. Whatever the hell spice mix is for, I have no idea, but if we get some chili, we can, we can make it. <laughs> this mod is so freaking complex. I still have no idea how, do I, how I even get to crafting my own dinosaurs. Like, I know at some point you craft giant, like leaf, Leaf vegetation dinosaurs, but at this point I'm still getting like mint. <laughs> I'm so far behind. There is like the distiller. I just kind of crafted some of this stuff because it just kind of needed empty jars. Ooh, aloe vera. There we go. Make some aloe vera gel. A product derived from the aloe aloe vera gel, which is obtained from the water storage tissue of the leaves. The gel is said to have anti-inflammatory, wound healing, and immune stimulating properties. I remember one time my my ex girlfriend got attacked at a gas station with a with a squeegee, like a windshield wiper by some crazy dude, and I got her an aloe vera plant, because literally if you put the freaking aloe stuff on your face, then you scar less. This is a pile of shit. I don't know what it does, it's just a poop surprise. Oh, this is a rainbow. Oh, I have a beautiful little garden going on right here, but I'm not necessarily sure what to do with it yet, but it is the basis of something amazing. Pretty much what I've done with the last day of my life. Still don't know how the hell scorpions are getting in here though, but yes. Oh, and this is my gazebo. And these are my haystacks. Uh, there's not a lot of- <laughs> there, there are a lot of crazy ways to, pay, to plot plant- plant pots? Pot- PLANT PLANTS! Damn it, that was hard. Like these things right here, right? But like, they were seeded, dude. I seeded these bad boys. The seed just kind of died inside of it. Or just spat out a plant species X seed. Which is not what- that's so weird how everything's turning into plant species X. Cause that's not what they were before. And this is basically where I left off on this mod. This is essentially- oh, chamomile. I could start to work my- I could maybe get a mother herb. Oh my god, I think this is the next- Yeah, we only need seven more chamomile. We have three. We need to plant some more of that bad boy. And then this mother herb also card, the fever few, was already described as a medical herb by the something- oh my god. I'm learning too much for how early it is right now. It's-, it's everything's going in one ear and out the other. I already forgot the thing I have to plant. Some of this stuff just starts to sound crazy too, like this source of malice. Nature can also be cruel, but nothing that evil or nothing that appears evil is also evil. There's a balance between life and destruction. Life has to be taken to create a new one. Like what? What could that possibly do? And then this one over here, Wrath of the Earth. The Earth will take revenge if you don't take care of it. I, I would need to craft it. I don't know what the hell that is, but I need to craft it. Breath of nature, can you feel it? I have no idea what that even is either. Some, 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 some. Ghost of the seas, the stormy rough seas can give life but also take away. What? Like I, what in the world could that be? Where's my chamomile? There we go, baby. Gonna get one of them going. I feel like we could get more, yeah, we could, okay. I'm not gonna make the whole episode about planting, okay? We just had to get it done in the front because people need to know this mod's insane. It's not just some gardening mod, all right? I'm not losing my mind this. <laughs> Damn, these take so long to craft, these freaking composts, but they work as mega poop, right? That's what I've been using them for. Yeah, three times more high nitrogen than regular poop. Well, these are freaking compost middles. There's small, middle, and large. But the large ones just, I have so much dirt. I am so dirt rich right now. Dirt money bags over here. Crap, these babies get expensive is the thing. It's gonna pull like, because it uses four fast composts. I guess these are middles. So I should be good. Yeah, they get pretty expensive. And I do have 
one extra one over here, which is gonna ruin the entire motif, but it looks beautiful. It's just a compost pile. It's just a, a pile of poop. But like, I'm pretty sure it works the same as regular stuff. It's just for like outdoor gardening and stuff for those of us who want to be extremely fancy. But I'm just gonna place the big old pile of shit right in the middle of the room. Okay, wait, what did I do? What did I pick up? What did I drop? Oh no, I deposited, okay. So we'll just go ahead and too lazy for an irrigation system. I'm, I feel like you guys all knew that about me. I totally look like the kind of guy who's too lazy for, for, for an irrigation system. Damn! 150,000 fertilizer just from one? I didn't pay attention to it when it did it before. Okay, cool. So this should give us, by the time next episode starts, the resources we need to continue this plant mod. I feel like that's the way to do it. Because I admit it probably is kind of boring to watch some dude garden for 20 minutes. That's why today I just wanted to catch you guys up on everything. But... That's all, I'll just catch you guys up on stuff. It's not really that climactic. You don't really have to hunt anything. It's all basic food resources. Okay, I feel like the world crashed again because I'm flying past... <laughs> I'm flying past the Megalodon. <laughs> you ever just feel like your arc world isn't doing so good? Like, so, so... <laughs> something might just be off. Perhaps it feels a little different than it usually does. Okay, I don't even know if I should even try... <laughs> like finishing this video like do I even keep recording? I feel like it's gonna keep crashing on me. We're gonna give it another attempt We're pretty sure Chris is pretty sure that it's the Pacific Rim mod You got to be very careful adding Chinese stuff to your world because the mods just are made in certain ways to Just destroy anyone who downloads them without certain paywall codes. It's like pretty destructive how they work Odin, it's okay, buddy So far so good. Odin, it's okay, buddy thinks people are trying to kill us. Normally I like his barking. I want people to know if they come in here, we're gonna kill them. But right now, you know, I'm recording. <laughs> Just right now, buddy. Oh my God, someone take a picture. I'm like 30 seconds into this and the server hasn't crashed yet. Holy shit, this is farther than I've ever thought I'd get in my life. It's been like an hour. <laughs> it's been like an hour of just server rebooting and uninstalling mods and stuff. Chris goes even streaming right now. He's a legend for doing this while he's streaming. Thank God. Okay, yes, the sea creatures are in the water. That's what I like to see. That's where they belong. <laughs> Rodan's coming over the hill. Oh my God, we might get an arc video out of this just yet. And look, the Megalodons are still in the water. I never thought it'd be possible. Woof, it's a whole new world. Need to go turn the air conditioner back on. I keep turning it off and on every five minutes because I'm recording and then stopping. <laughs> I get really hot when I record because I yell a lot. Okay, so according to this thingy majigger, Rodan should be right. Oh, there he is. Okay, yeah, didn't see, that's why we need it because you literally can't. Okay, he's got nine million torpor. We can shoot off to the back of him. I freaking knew we could. The server was just crashing, but it does do a lot of torpor. If I miss it's gonna blow up on us and probably put us both to sleep. <laughs> so, yeah, I try to avoid that. I think Rodan has one of those crazy kaiju aiming thing or targeting things where they just target anything. Nope, he's tar he's aggroed on us instantly. <laughs> All right, but usually they just aggro on whatever's closest to them. I'm pretty sure, which is how I'm gonna try and tame this guy. I guess I should just shoot him off to Austria, but I'm gonna feel really stupid if I miss. How close do I have to get? Whoop, too close! Oh, this is gonna be such a pain in the ass. Come on, buddy. Where do you aggro? I mean, where's your targeting thing? Oh my god, for like a split second it locks on. That's like our only side of hope right there. Oh god. Please log on! Woof! Oh, Jesus Christ. I don't even think that thing... I don't even know where that just went. It seems to have just blown up on him. But it did nothing! I can't see over your fluffy wings, buddy. Come on. Come on. Stay within render distance of it. Maybe that makes all the difference. He's spinning in a crazy ass circle. He's impossible. It's hitting stuff behind him because of his crazy turn radius. Oof. We got smacked. He slows you down a lot when he smacks you, so I'm trying to avoid. Can you stop flying like that? It's impossible for the heat seekers to hit you. These are expensive. Dead dinosaurs on the ground. You just sit down, buddy. That'd be fantastic. Move your face, Teostra. All right, we're going to go on foot. I feel like his aggro distance is so goofy that we'll have a chance because he's going to try to attack. Why do I hear 939s? That changes everything. That little howl, that dog howl is the devil. Come on. Oh, if he's sitting down like that, that'd be so perfect. 
That'd be like the prime time to shoot him. What is he doing now? This is the opposite of prime time. If I shoot you now, it won't lock. I mean, it won't hit. It's just gonna spiral after him, and they're so expensive. You gotta be really close with this thing, don't you? It's unfortunate, because it's a heat-seeking thing, and he's like literally a flying volcano. It should... No matter where you uh, aim it, it should, it should get him. Come on, little feller. Oh, you're flooping the- Oh my god, they don't- they don't follow for long enough. He's too fast, dude. I might need some kind of giant- Odin! Oh my god, he scared the crap out of me. He just went- oh! oh my god! He went crazy barking. I thought someone was breaking in. I was distracted! Shit! Okay, there. He's in my room now on his beanbag. He should be okay. No more last minute distractions. <laughs> Wait, I forgot this guy can't fly when he's sprinting. Okay, this may be a serious issue. These these homing rockets were like a bitch together. If he just starts dodging them all, I'm gonna need to think of something else. Last time we did like overhaul X. Oh, I forgot you can't downwards glide. Last time we did overhaul X and we had those giant crazy domes to slap over them. That was like the best way to tame Rodan. This one is such a bastard. I faintly remember hours ago talking about gardening stuff. My entire day has been the server crashing now that I think about it. Ark is a bitch sometimes, but I always say like it may have a lot of issues, but if you wanna if you hate it, go play the other giant monster dinosaur taming survival game. It's like, oh wait, there isn't one? Yeah, that's right. So shut up and play Ark. <gasps> oh god. There's no uh visible death beacons? That makes this infinitely more difficult fighting my body. How's there no death beacons? What in the hell? Please don't kill me. Please for the- Oh, there is. I just died way over here. I'm stupid. Oh, I thought I died way back there. Okay. I, I could have seen that coming. Oh, shit. There's an Anjanath. Usually so pretty, but now when I'm running on foot as a jabroni human, this just got terrible. Oh, God. in a freaking Rajang. Everything sucks. Oh god! Duck! Something! Oh, that was my chance, bro. That was my only chance in the whole world. Here he comes. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! This is just constant terror and failure. That's <laughs> what this is. <laughs> nice little breaks of failure in between my terror. Oh! Son of a bitch! I knew this would happen. I totally predicted this. I'm so excited to to get back up and fail again. I don't, Rodan's, he's making me speak gibberish. He's overloading my brain nuggets. All right, and we're awake. Redemption shall be mine. We just come back and all my features are dead on the beach. This dude could be literally anywhere. That's why the tracker exists. Ah, oh, crap, dude, he's like right there. <laughs> it's such a pain in the ass tracking him. Get on the ground, Johnny. Aim up, but from the ground. It's the only way to survive around here. Oh, he sounds so beautiful. I love Rodan so much. That's why he was the first one. Oh, God damn it! I hate everything! What a roller coaster of emotion! Slowly going and saying, Oh my God, it finally stopped. It finally stopped shooting! No way! That thing actually died? I thought that was the time the laser was actually gonna go on for the rest of my life. Like, I was positive all I was gonna hear for the rest of eternity was just pew, pew, pew for. Forever. I should start. Ooh, yeah, I'm a fly TIE fighter over there. What the hell am I gonna take these these little guys for? We have a freaking Air Force. Air Force. Air Force is the good word for it. All those fails, we just destroy Rodan with a TIE fighter. That sounds freaking awesome. How are we doing on fuel? Fuel good, lasers good. Flying over our farm and our TIE fighter from our Teen Titans base. This series is too amazing. It's crazy how much money has gone into the series. <laughs> Actually, I didn't commission the Star Wars stuff, or obviously the Teen Titans stuff, so that was a bad example. Or the farm stuff. But that doesn't mean a lot of money hasn't gone into the survival series. I should just blow his ass out of the sky. No. No one clicked on this video for me to blow ass. Whoop! Sunday driver! Ran right into that guy. I swear if he destroys my TIE fighter, that's gonna be a new level of insulting. Let's just hover for a second. Let me retract this guy. He might be right in front of our face and we'd have no idea. I wonder if I could take him. <laughs> Stop flying into me! It would be pretty wild if we could take him though. But what's the point of that, Johnny? What's the takeaway? Yeah, I gotta I gotta think about this logically. I'm gonna walk away with the rotan. Whoa god! How do I park these things again? Oh yeah, just kinda. <laughs> 
I forgot. Oh yeah, I don't know how to park them. Is that turtle under us gonna be an issue? Everything should be fine. I didn't even bring beds originally. I didn't think I'd fail at this. I was like, I'm the perfect, most cunning warrior in the world. How can this possibly go wrong? But evidently there's a way. Who's making that? Oh yeah, it's that one SCP. It's like, who's pissing their pants over here? It's a colossal flushing of noise of water. I think, I, I always joke that I had a stroke, but I think that one was actually it. <laughs> I think that one was the end. Okay, as long as we have our Boba Fett helmets, we should be fine. That's all we necessarily need. Well, obviously, and the jetpack. The jetpack is actually all we need. The helmet is, <laughs> it serves no purpose. All right, you bastard. That just looks uncomfortable. So you get a hell of a wedgie with a parachute with no pants on. Note to self. Oh, God! Shit, if he comes back around, please don't attack my stuff. No! Yeah, it's it. Fly away from him. Somehow, mystically. Well, don't come this way either. There's no right direction for you right now, buddy. Crap. Crap. Crap! No! My TIE Fighter! Come on, man! <laughs> What's the goddamn problem, Rodan? What's your beef, Kimosabi? Oh, and of course, the homing rocket's not even as fast as him because Rodan flies, like, faster than sound. Like, breaks the sound barrier. I'm, I'm losing so much stuff right now. <laughs> Don't you do it. I feel like I gotta cry up on those guys. I'm severely worried for them now. I can see their health from here, though. They're doing good. They're unscathed. No, 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 no this is death! This is death! Oh, I thought it was death for sure. <gasps> <gasps> Oh, you can't even just let one hit, can you? <laughs> you can't even give me a false sense of hope right now. <laughs> he flies so much faster than them. He's so big! Come on, man. Come on, dude. Don't you do it. I don't even want to shoot you. I gotta wait till he sits down. I gonna... Oh, that one would have hit because he stopped. I hate myself. Stay locked on to you until... <laughs> Did that one get him? That one got him. I'm the best that's ever lived. It only did 300,000. I don't think we have enough. <laughs> it's worth a shot. I'm gonna keep going for it. Did that one get him? He made it know it. No, it's still on him. Crap. I had high hopes. I'm gonna keep at this though. Never surrender. It's just narco berries. They're replaceable. Everything's replaceable. Except for that TIE Fighter, I could make a new one, but it won't be the same. I think you totally singe your ass cheeks. Oh god! I was gonna say on this jetpack. Like with no pants on? <laughs> Most definitely. Yes! Oh good, it hit but didn't register. That's my favorite kind. The one that gets your hopes up and then breaks your heart after. That's what it's all about, baby. Oh, come on! Alright. I'm, uh, ooh. <laughs> he's, he's pissing me off a little. It's become a repressed memory. The quickest repressed, oh, I hit him twice. I am God. I don't remember, it must have been that time when I, when I died. I don't even know. Oh okay, yeah, that was scary. It's always scary. Just gonna keep it on him. Oh, if I hit this rock, then I die. I got him, but I got myself too. But I got him, but I got myself too. I was looking at memes and he just killed my sleeping body. Bully, bro. Absolute bully. What was even the point of that? Oh God. What's he doing all the way over there? That's weird. Suspicious behavior, Rodan. How is he aggro on me already? Why? Oh my God, he did. Dude, that was ridiculous, right? <laughs> he was aggro on me before he came even into render distance. Unbelievable. No, I didn't mean to do that. Now I'm gonna drown. Great, good job, Johnny. Good job, you stupid idiot. Where is he? Where is he at? He's right over there. He's not moving, so maybe he's stuck. That would be so amazing if he was just stuck right now. That'd be the best thing ever, but our luck isn't that good. But he isn't moving. Not moving is the most amazing sign ever. And there he goes moving. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Why do I even have hopes to get up in the first place? Whoop! 
Oh my god, I got like, this, this is the last time I need to be getting robbed by birds right now. There's never a good time to be getting robbed by birds, but this has got to be the worst time possible. Okay. No, oh, not robbed by freaking beach bandits now! The crime in this place is just terrible. I can't stand anywhere without random creatures jumping me. Oh, this is death. Oh, 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 come on, he was stuck for just a second! You don't think my life is hard enough with you here, buddy? What was another one? Unbelievable. And where did he go? Okay. I don't even, I don't think so. Where you at? Where you at, thief? Show yourself! Oh, reloading. Where did he go? Okay, he's still right over there. I've got this. <laughs> I don't think I have this at all, but I appreciate my effort. I'm impressed by myself. <laughs> Can't believe a bird stole my canteen. That was a bird need a canteen for. That doesn't make any damn sense. He's got unlimited water supply at his feet. Did that hit him? I think it did. No, I meant to shoot a freaking. Not that. Whoa, that one almost accidentally hit him. Damn Tylos. Can't they just see me blasting some of their buddies into the like smithereens and be taught a lesson? Oh shit. Oh, I thought for sure. I thought for sure that one was death. I wasn't backing out though. I ain't no sissy! I don't necessarily see if I shoot it now, it's gonna heat seek behind him. You gotta wait till he's coming around a bit. Whoa. Oh, but then he pulls a total plot twist on that one. Oh, that one got you, didn't it, you slippery bastard? Easy, easy. Now's your time, Johnny! Oh, God. I don't even care if he got me. That was a good one. If I just got him twice for every death, I'd have him by now, because I've died like 70,000 times. Where's the jet? Dude, this jetpack and helmet are holding so strong. They're the real MVPs of all this. Absolutely. 2.4 out of 9.3. That's not at all depressing considering the amount of time I put into this. But he'd be so worth it though. Hold. Hold. I feel like he's too high for this one. Oh, he just got low at the last second. What a cheeky bastard. Now where's he going? Hold. Jump. Fly. Fly. I know those big ass feet steps anywhere. Bastard. All right, back on the mission. As I'm trained, trained to detect those carno feet steps. Oh my god! No! Okay, well, several, se se several, can't even speak anymore. Resource runs back to base. This guy is so freaking close to being tamed. He's been on the run for the past 20 minutes, making him way easier to hit. He doesn't really attack me as much, but then I ran out of stuff. It's been so long. Like, this has been the craziest thing ever. Thank God it's such a beautiful world full of awesome monsters, because otherwise this would have sucked a lot of balls. Oh, now he's finally going back over there. Oh my God. He's just on the run for it, but he's about to go down. Like two more missiles and he goes down. Stop aggroing on me and just... Okay, you're, you're too slow. This creature is not fast enough. This is why we chose Tiastra. You lose me on the downfall. I mean, I lose you. No, I catch you. I, ca I catch you the other one. I've literally forgotten how to speak. Oh, that was so close. Oh, there's monsters beneath this road, Dan. You do not want to go to sleep here, dude. Whoops! The hell just happened down there? So much evil was just summoned right beneath me. I distinctly just heard Zilla 1998 roar. Or was that Godzilla? Is there a Godzilla beneath us? Oh, what's this crazy ass funeral music now? I'm just trying to guess what's beneath us by the various music I keep playing, and it, honestly, they don't sound good. Oh my god. I freaking got him. Oh, he's so close. He's. Oh my god, he's going down. Holy shit. That was the craziest thing in my freaking life right there. I don't even have mutton on me. I can't believe he's gone down. I'm gonna go get mutton. Oh my god, oh, that was crazy, dude. I could not have followed that guy around for longer. I knew we'd let his guard down eventually. I knew he would. That turn radius could only protect him for so for so freaking long. Oh, I just gotta find some sheep. I should have been more prepared for this, but honestly, that was I was I was so prepared an hour or two ago between the crashes and like the 300 or so deaths. I didn't even. Like, probably won't even include the video because they were just, 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 just too much, man. My point is, I was once prepared, and I'm not prepared at all anymore. The farthest thing from prepared, but it's fine. Because there's sheep all over the place. <laughs> Lots of mutton. And we still have those other things, right? From the before time, the concentrated MSG to make him have more of an appetite. Good, 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 good. 
Yes! Oh my god, yes! What's cooking, good looking? Oh. Ooh, that's a fat chunk of fall damage. I should have seen that coming. Is this safe for me to touch down? Yeah, you know what? Now that I look a little closer, I do kind of notice the SCPs in front of my face. Maybe just supply some fire right here. Get that 939 out of here. You too, just for being rambunctious. All the troublemakers dead. Come on! There's always an extra troublemaker. I swear, if any of this is hurting Rotan right now, okay, it's not. And if it is, it's hurting him such a minuscule amount that it's doing nothing. Fly right up to our buddy, land on him, and all is well. I forgot to get the button out of my creature. Admittedly, I have low blood sugar and I haven't eaten in like four hours due to all this, so I am gonna start getting pretty stupid. But I think that won't be much of a change as to when I'm just like cracked out from Red Bull and also being stupid. Where's your inventory, buddy? There we go. All right, plop you in there. I guess just consume it as the will be. Oh, he's like eating the whole thing instantly. Oh, yes, dude. 250% taming. No, 300% taming. 360% taming. Okay, now I feel like the server's breaking again. What's going on here? Oh my god, look at this. Too many tames, 45 out of 50. Crisco said I asked him if this was an issue when I wasn't able to tame those Rotans. I mean, those Dodos in the beginning of the episode. He said, no, dude, this is, we're allowed to have like a thousand creatures on this survival series. Oh my god, Crisco, you lying butthole. I obviously can't let him restart the server and then reach in and change it because then Rodan won't be asleep anymore. It's going to reset everything, which means we have to go kill like six creatures right now. That's, that's sad. And then he has to adjust it. I told him, dude. I told him the server needed more room for more stuff. He's like, no, Brian, there's plenty of room. Dude, there's clearly not plenty of room. I'm going to have to tame all new dodos for the subscribers. Like, to have out named after subscribers, I mean, as was the original plan. Because these ones sort of have to be gunned down criminal style. Sorry, little buddy. I will take your guys' poop, though. I'm not a monster. That should do it, right? I can't remember the exact number, but just to be safe. Oh, shit. That's what I'm talking about, baby. Results. Freaking results. You gotta really drag the R on it to make it very unpleasant. I don't know why when I get off the Ostra, I'm so buggy. I gotta use my jetpack to, to be normal after. Why did that thing just go red on me? What the hell is that? Oh, it's an SCP. All right. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. One more murder standing in my way of justice stands it is no issue. I've committed mass genocide today on multiple exist like multiple species. One more is totally fine. Pretty sure you don't need a saddle, right, buddy? I was the one who originally commissioned this guy, and I'm pretty sure you don't. Oh, Rodan, finally back in my hands where you belong, buddy. Yes! The fire demon is reborn. I have been given new life. Which is good, too, because this shall replace our TIE fighter that he destroyed. Oh, that's what's all the paths. Just being near stuff, and then they die. That's true power. Oh, there's a rainbow. What a beautiful, th what a beautiful thing. Oh, God, I love Rodan. The reason I sponsored Rodan out of the other monsters first, and the reason I, um... I, it just honestly, the reason I chose him was because he's such an asshole in Godzilla King of Monsters. Like, such a colossal douchebag. Of, like, out of all of them, if I had to rank one as the biggest bastard, I would have ranked it as Rotan. Because he's just, like, without even meaning to, just destroying entire cities. Like, he's just... The rest of them at least mean to when they destroy populations. He's just such a bastard, he does it on accident. I like how... Did we just grab something? No. I'm trying to remember our moves. I think we have the swipe. How did that just do 11,000, but that one did like 200? I feel like he's trying to pick stuff up. It's been so long, I can't even remember how to use him. Definitely hits for a shit ton, but not like a broken mouse. Can't increase his speed, so we go health and damage for sure. Yeah, we only do like 250 upon smacking into stuff, I think. It's not actually that much of an unstoppable monster. Fits into vanilla pretty spanking well. 
All in all, I love this creature to death, but I do have to end this episode here because if I don't eat relatively soon, then I am gonna start getting very dizzy and then editing is gonna be a very funny process. Either way though, baby, the future of the survival series, Mr. Blue Sky and Rodan hanging out together. Oh, they look so perfect, like the best of buddies meant to hang out. Oh, can't wait till Kong's done, the, like the Kong commission I sponsored. Either way though, I'm gonna go eat before I faint. Leave a like on the video, subscribe, and I'll see you beautiful people in the next episode. Peace.